Hi team. So it's been a week almost since I got my OnePlus Nord and I'm thoroughly impressed with it. As I mentioned last time though, there is the issue of bloatware and I linked an article in my previous video which shows you how to remove the Facebook bloatware from the OnePlus 8 series and the OnePlus Nord. And there's three apps in particular from Facebook, the Facebook App Installer, the Facebook Services and the Facebook App Manager. Um, and also not from Facebook, but from Netflix, another app that you are unable to uninstall from the OnePlus Nord and the 8 series. So I thought I'll show you how to do that today. Now, if you go into your apps and you have a look at the list of apps that you've got installed, you can look at any old app. I'm going to show the Garmin Connect app and usually you have the option to uninstall the app. However, in the case of the Facebook apps, there's no uninstall option. You can see it there also for the Facebook app manager and Facebook services. They only allow you to disable them, which I'd already done, but I want to uninstall them. Netflix, Netflix is the same. So you can only disable the app. You can't uninstall it. So I thought, let me show you how to do it. Now, the first thing that you are going to have to do is you're going to have to go to your OnePlus device and go down to about phone. And in here, you've got to click the build number seven times. This allows you to enable developer access, which gives you certain additional accesses to your phone. And by doing this allows you to um, enable developer options and then the USB debugging mode. Um, and that will allow us to connect our computer to the phone. And from here, we can manually uninstall those apps. So plug your computer into the, into the phone using the USB-C cable. And then if you um, come over to the article, which I previously linked, and I'll link in this video as well, there's a number of commands that you've got to run within the ADB shell. Now, they're all listed there on the left-hand side. Um, and I'm using Linux pop OS, uh, which is very similar to Ubuntu, but it's going to be quite similar for Mac and for windows. I'll see if I can find an article, uh, in the case of those two, and I'll link them below. So if you can see here, I'm just going one by one through all of the apps to make it nice and simple. In each case, I'm getting a success, uh, on uninstalling the app and that's removing that app from the device. I'm also going to remove the Netflix app, um, it, which is a little bit different, not listed in this article. And for some reason, the behavior was a tiny bit different within the app when I go and have a look later on. Uh, it did remove the device, but it, it left um, um, an icon and saying this app is not installed for this user. In the case of the Facebook services, which are installed on the phone, um, the good part was that they were gone. Now, keep in mind, you're going to have to do this every time you get an update. So unfortunately, it's not just a one off. But having said that, it's pretty straightforward. Now, if I go to the apps and we'll scroll down and you'll notice that there is no longer any Facebook app uh, listed in the app menu. And also oh, in the app list, rather. And also, if we scroll down a bit further, there is the Netflix app, but it says not installed for this user. So it's really that simple. Um, I hope that this tutorial was useful and um, please like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos. Thanks.